B1, what are all those boxes doing outside Rat's shop? Let's go and find out, B2. Hello, Hello Rat. Oh, cheeks and whiskers. Is something wrong, Rat? I ordered two boxes of porridge for the shop, but they've delivered 20. What will I do with them all? Can we do anything to help, Rat? I suppose you could help me carry them into the shop. We'll have them inside in no time. Here it is, Rat. The last box. Thank you, Bananas. Now, how am I going to sell 20 boxes of porridge? Would you like to buy a box? This porridge is the most delicious breakfast food there is. It does smell nice, B1. Sort of. <coughs> See? Isn't it yummy? Uh, how old is this porridge, Rat? Old? Oh, only a couple of years. Uh, I mean weeks. Uh, days! It's very thick and sticky. Thick and sticky? It's like glue. Does that mean you won't buy any? Sorry, Sorry Rat. Rat. But there was something we wanted to buy, wasn't there, B1? Oh, yes. What was it, B2? I can't remember, B1. We'll have to come back later when we think of it. Bye, Bye Rat. Rat! Bye, Bananas! Oh, How am I ever going to sell all this porridge? Hello, Rat! Oh, hello, Charlie! I need to buy some glue for a new invention I'm building. Glue? Yes, a thick and sticky glue. Thick, sticky, glue. I think I might have just the thing, Charlie. But there you go, thick and sticky. Hello, Rat. I need some plaster to fix the cracks in my ceiling. Plaster? Oh, sorry, Bernard. I don't have any pla... Uh, wait a minute. I might have some after all. That will fix your ceiling in no time. Thank you so much. Hello, Rat. I'm making a vase, so I need some clay. A clay? Well, Amy, I have just what you need right here. I'm a rat, I'm a rat, I'm a clever, clever rat. Maybe we were going to buy a trumpet, B1. No, I don't think it was that, B2. Oh! What happened? It was that big hole in the path. Now I remember what we were going to buy, B1. Cement! Cement to fill the hole. Let's go back to Rat's shop, B1. Cement? Oh, sorry, Bananas. I don't sell some... Uh, on second thoughts, I might have a box here somewhere. That's wonderful, Rat. Yes, isn't it? Oh, there you go. Cement. It should do the job perfectly. Uh, haven't we seen this box before somewhere, P1? It does look familiar, P2. And uh, it's very easy to use, Bananas. You just add water. OK, Rat. We'll buy two boxes, then. Uh, that'll be four honey cakes, please. Excellent. The last piece. Ah, 
That's a job well done, if ever I saw one. Ooh, that rat in the hat! Finished! Now, let's see how it looks with flowers. Oh! My beautiful vase! What happened? That rat in a hat! Here comes the cement, B2. Oh, sorry, B2. Don't worry, B1. I'll just scoop some off. Very thick and sticky, B1. It's like glue, B2. And it smells like old porridge, B1. Oh, you're right, B2. Oh, that, that rat, rat in a hat. hat! Look at this. We've all got the same boxes. So we do. Don't tell me you bought some of Rat's terrible glue, too. Glue? He told me it was clay. He told me it was plaster. And he told us it was cement. But if it isn't clay... And it isn't plaster... And it isn't glue or cement... Then, then what, what is, is it? it? It's old porridge. Old, old porridge? <laughs> That's right. Oh, oh that, that rat, rat in a hat. hat. We should go in there and tell him how naughty he's been. Wait a minute, everyone. I've got a better idea. What is it, Charlie? The weather forecast says it's going to rain this afternoon. So? So I think we have the perfect chance to teach that naughty rat a lesson. <laughs> hello, rat. Oh, hello, bananas. What can I do for you? We'd like five boxes of cement, please, rat. <laughs> Why do you need so much cement bananas? We're going to build a statue of someone very important. Someone very important? Who? You! Me! Oh, bananas! I always thought I was loved by everyone in Cuddlestown. Now I know it! <laughs> <laughs> so can we buy the cement now, please, Rat? The cement? Oh, yes, of course. Oh, uh, bananas, are you sure that por... Uh, I mean, cement is the best thing to build this statue with? Oh, yes, Rat. It's perfect, isn't it, B1? Absolutely, B2. <laughs> <laughs> well, as long as you're sure. There, bananas. Go forth and build a statue to honour Cuddles Town's finest citizen. As I'm sure you all know, Rat is a very important person in Cuddles Town. After all, without Rat, what would we do if we needed clay? Or plaster. Or glue. Or, or cement. cement. So, we've made something special for you, Rat. It's your very own... Statue! Yay! Thank you, everyone. You're far too kind. It's a beautiful statue. Well, naturally, because it looks exactly like me. I'm sure that each day as you walk through the park, it will remind you all of how wonderful I have been. <laughs> <laughs> Did I say something funny? Look behind you, Rat. Oh, no! My beautiful statue! The rain's making it melt. Oh, but uh, how could that happen? Cement doesn't melt, does it? Cement? No, of course it doesn't. Then what's caused it? Well... Unless it uh, isn't cement at all. <laughs> Just like the clay wasn't clay. And the glue wasn't glue. And the plaster wasn't plaster. It was all just old porridge. Old porridge? Oh dear, I have been a naughty rat, haven't I? Yes! But if you all knew it was old porridge, 
Why did you build this? We wanted to trick you back. What? You tricked me! But we only did our trick to show up your trick. And it was funny, don't you think? <laughs> <laughs> yes, I suppose it was. Oh! Wait! If you all come to my shop, I'll give you free afternoon tea. Free afternoon tea, B1? Oh, sounds good to me, B2. Yay! I hope rats serving munchy honey cakes, B1. And yellow jelly, B2. Here you go, everyone. Afternoon tea. Wait a minute, B1. Is that what we think it is, B2? Rat, this is old porridge. It's slightly old porridge and it's perfect for a cold day. So eat up, everyone. Oh, rat in a hat. <laughs> it's morning tea time, B1. And what's for morning tea, B2? What else? Yellow jelly! And munchy honey cakes! Yum! Did you hear that, B1? I hear it, B2. That sounds like... Postman Rat! Good morning, Postman Rat. Good morning, Bananas. Do you have any letters for us today? Any letters? Hmm, let me see. Ah, a postcard for the tippies. A parcel for Pedro. No, that's my lunch. An umbrella for the rain. My trusty postman's ladder for delivering letters to anyone living upstairs. Ah, here we are. One letter for the bananas. Thanks, Postman Rat. I wonder what it is. It's an invitation from Bernard to his special event this afternoon. Uh, not that I know, of course. I certainly haven't opened it and uh, read it. Postman Rat would never do that. Uh, bye! <gasps> Look, B1. What is it, B2? It is from Bernard. What a lucky guess by Postman Rat, B2. A very lucky guess. And it looks like his special event is going to be very special. Wow! Do you think the special event might be Bernard's birthday, B1? It has to be, B2. Then we need to get him a present. But what kind of present? What sort of thing would he like? We need to find out more about Bernard, B2. But how, B1? We need to do some spying, B2. Hmm, where we sneak around and watch others. But they don't know that we're watching them. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B2? I think I am, B1. It's Super Spy Banana Time! A mission? What kind of mission? A top secret mission. Top secret? Shh! Not so loud. Sorry. If it's top secret, it must be very important. All clear, B1? All clear, B2. Shh! Here, Bananas. What is it, Charlie? Everything a super spy needs. A super spy telescope to see things a long way away. A pen full of invisible ink so you can write down everything you see. And best of all, your super spy disguises. A disguise? Is that like dressing up, B2? Shh! It's dressing up so no one knows who you are, B1. Your super spy hats, your super spy sunglasses, and most important of all, your super spy moustaches. Thanks, Charlie. Now we've got everything we need, B1. Shh! Everything we need to be real super spies, B2. All clear, super spy B1? All clear, super spy B2. Now we're ready to find out what Bernard really likes. So we can choose the perfect birthday present. Look out! Here he comes now. Quick, hide. I'm so looking forward to this. I want my special event to be extra special. 
I think I smell honey, Super Spy B1. I think I hear bees, Super Spy B2. Bees! bees. Run, Super Spy B1. I am running, Super Spy B2. That was close, Super Spy B2. Oh, much too close, Super Spy P1. Come on, we'd better find Bernard. I think he went that way. Thank you, Master Rat. I am greatly indebted to you. Not a problem, Bernard. And remember, I need everything delivered to Barkington House in time for my special event. But of course, Bernard. As I always say, if you can't trust a rat, who can you trust? I give up. Uh, who can you trust? No, it's just a saying. A saying I always say. If you can't trust a rat... <laughs> oh, right, right. Uh, who can you trust? <laughs> oh, very witty. Uh, well, uh, keep up the good work. Cheerio, rat. Bye, Bernard. Oh! Oh, uh, good afternoon, strangers. Welcome to my shop. They're funny. You look just like my friends the Bananas, uh, but with hats and sunglasses and great big moustaches. Bananas in moustaches? What a silly idea. <laughs> <laughs> yes, quite. Now, is there something I can help you with? Yes. What was Bernard buying from your shop? Bernard? Or just 20 dog food bowls? 20 dog food bowls? Why would he need those? For his special event. Hmm. Thanks, Mr. Rat. You've been very helpful. I'm sure I know them from somewhere. Very good, Morgan. That sounds excellent. Anything else you need, Bernard? Uh, no, Morgan. Uh, that's all. Just uh, 20 flying discs, 20 skipping ropes and 20 bouncing balls. Your special event's going to be super special. That's the idea, Morgan. See you there. Bye, Bernard. Did you hear that? 20 flying discs. 20 skipping ropes. And 20 bouncing balls. That's a lot of toys to play with. So if Morgan's giving Bernard toys... And Rat's giving Bernard balls... What can we give him? We need to find out more about him. Careful, Super Spy B1. Don't let Bernard see us. Right you are, Super Spy B2. Hmm. That's funny. I thought I heard someone. Huh? Oh, I must be working too hard on my special event. Look, Super Spy B1. There's Bernard with Camembert. Let's see what they're saying, Super Spy B2. Excellent, Camembert. And remember, I need enough milk to fill 20 bottles. 20 bottles of milk? He must be really thirsty. Look out, here he comes. Quick, hide. Huh? Help, B1. I've got you, B2. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh, hello, Bananas. Uh, what are you doing here? We're not doing anything. No, nothing at all. Just taking our moustaches for a walk. Mm -hmm. Oh, I see. Uh, oh, well, uh, have a nice time. And, and remember, don't be late for my special event at Barkington House. Now, let's see. What has our super spying taught us about Bernard, B1? We know he likes food, B2. And he loves to play games, B1. And he's very, very thirsty, B2. So, what are we going to get? We need the perfect present. Perfect present? What do you need that for, Bananas? For Bernard's special event. We just can't think of what to get. Oh, what about a bone? A bone? All dogs love bones. That's it, B1. A bone, B2. That would be the most perfect present ever. Congratulations, Bernard. This is an excellent party. Oh, why, thank you, Rat. Hello, Bernard. Oh, welcome, Bananas. Oh, goodness me, what's that you've got? It's for you, Bernard. For me? It's your present. 
present? Happy birthday, Bernard! Oh, bananas, you make me wag! Why is that, Bernard? Uh, it's not my birthday. It's not? But it's your special event. It's a special event to collect things for all the puppies in the lost puppy home. Oh, really? Didn't you see Bernard's invitation, Bananas? Yes, but we didn't see anything about lost puppies. It was on the other side of the card, Bananas. You see? Uh, uh, if only we'd known, we could have brought something for the lost puppies too. And all we have is this bone. Which is really 20 small bones wrapped up like one big bone. Because we thought you liked 20 of everything. No, no, no. There are 20 lost puppies, so they need 20 bowls and 20 toys. Uh, 20 of everything, in fact. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B1? I think I am, B2. Puppies like bones, just like big dogs. So our 20 bones will be perfect for the 20 lost puppies. Yay! Yay! Well, I never, never, ever. Well done, Bananas. The puppies will love them. Wow, B1, we brought Bernard the perfect present after all. And we didn't even know it. Really? It's coming, Bananas. It's coming! What's coming, Rat? Help is coming! <laughs> Hear that? Help has arrived! Here it is. Doesn't it look good? How will the box help you? <laughs> it's not the box, Bananas. It's what's inside the box. Behold! The perfect helper is here! <gasps> A, a robot. robot! Not just a robot, but a ratamat robot. Oh, jeez and whiskers. Just look at these instructions. Not that I need them. Shouldn't you read the instructions, Rat? To make sure it works properly? I don't have time for silly things like instructions. <laughs> Greetings. I am Ratamat. How may I help you? It moves. It speaks. What is your command? Speak, and Ratamat will obey. Obey my every command! Oh, the joy! Ratamat, my shop has dust everywhere. I command you to clean! <laughs> Ratamat must clean. Ratamat will do so. Wow! <laughs> oh, isn't this brilliant, Bananas? <laughs> Robot? Not just a robot, a ratamat. This we've got to see. Good morning, Teddies. I take it that the bananas have told you about my amazing new ratamat. They have. Can we see it? Follow me. Wow. Your shop has never been cleaner, Rat. All thanks to Ratamat. It does everything so I can do nothing. <laughs> and doing nothing is what you're so very good at, Rat. Correct! Greetings. I am Ratamat. How may I assist you? <gasps> it really it does, does work. work. These are my friends, Ratamat. Friends? What are friends? Don't you know what friends are, Ratamat? We're your friends, Ratamat. <laughs> alert! Alert! Sorry? Mud alert! Ratamat will not allow mud in shop! Ratamat must wash! Wash! Ah! My shoes! 
We were all in the garden. We all have mud. Wash, wash. <laughs> Sorry, Teddies, but Ratamat likes to keep a clean shop. Greetings. How may I help you? Uh, we'd like some jelly, please. Green jelly. Jelly, jelly. Where is your red jelly? But we wanted green, Ratamat. You do not want green. We don't? We thought we did. Ratamat says that red jelly is best. Take red jelly. Uh, thanks, Ratamat. We'll be going now. Keep up the good work, Ratamat. I'll be at the beach if you need me. Ratamat does not need rat. Ratamat can do everything. Ratamat will do everything. Rat! What can I do for you, Bananas? Or better yet, what can I get the Ratamat to do for you? <laughs> we have to talk to you about the Ratamat. And tell me how wonderful he is. No, Rat. We want to tell you how bossy he is. Bossy? And unhelpful. The Teddies think he's bossy too. No one wants to go into your shop anymore. What? <laughs> of course you do. Not if Ratamat's there. Goodness me, what a lot of fuss pots you are. Uh, very well. I'll talk to Ratamat. Thank, Thank you, Rat. Rat. Ten centimetres from edge of counter. Position is perfect. <laughs> Greetings. How may I assist you? It's come to my attention, Ratamat. Though I don't believe it, that you might be a little bossy. Bossy? What is bossy? You make us do things we don't want to do. Are you going to buy something? Uh... No. We just want to talk to you. Only customers may stay inside. Leave immediately. Uh, do you think we should go, B2? We should be one. Now, Ratamat, you can't chase my friends out of my shop. This is Ratamat's shop. Your shop? It's my shop. Leave immediately. Leave my own shop. Sand alert. Sand alert. Sand? Oh no, I was at the beach. <laughs> oh, cheese and whiskers. You're right, bananas. That Ratamat is way too bossy. What can you do, Rat? I wish I knew. What we need is an idea. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B2? I think I am, B1. Ratamat needs to have fun. It needs to have friends. It's Ratamat Playtime! Greetings. How may I assist you? Ratamat, would you like to have some fun? We'd like to invite you to a picnic. A meal eaten outside. How is that fun? Picnics are always fun. Very well. Ratamat will attend picnic to learn about fun. Banana Rama! We'll see you soon, Ratamat. What do you think, B2? It's perfect, B1. Do you think Ratamat will like it? Everyone loves a picnic. Greetings. Hello, Ratamat. Are you ready for some games? Ratamat only has two minutes for fun. We must commence picnic immediately. Uh, but it's not lunchtime yet, Ratamat. We should play first and then have the picnic later. Beep. Beep, beep, beep. This picnic is unsatisfactory. This sandwich is not cut in a straight line. This drink is too warm. This rug is crooked. Ratamat will straighten. Ah, catch them, B2. Catching, B1. Ooh, ah, 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 ah. Time allotted for picnic complete. Ratamat will leave. What do we do now, B2? I think we'd better put these back on the blanket, P1. Door locked. Ratamat did not lock door. <laughs> it was me who locked it. I've got my shop back, Ratamat. Sorry, there's nothing you can do about it. <laughs> huh? Greetings. Why are you in Ratamat's shop? Oh, cheese and whiskers. Oh! Oh! Rat! 
Over here! Ratamat has taken over my shop! I can't believe it! He's going to take over the whole village soon! We have to send him back where he came from! We have to catch him first! And how do we do that? With bait! Banana bait! Huh? I think that's enough mud, B2. Right, B1. Come and join me. Hey, Ratamat! Come and see this! There's a big mess outside your shop! Mud alert! Mud alert! Ratamat must wash! Here he comes! And here we go! Get ready! Now! We got him! Ready, Rat. Hey, Ratamad, <laughs> over here. Yes, it's me, and I've got very dirty feet. Dirt must clean, must clean. Success! We've got you now. <laughs> oh, I'm such a clever, clever rat. Fancy? That's not fair. Oh, oh, cheese and whiskers. Bananas. Plan. What's plan C? Whatever you can think of! And quickly! <laughs> Mud alert! Mud alert! Ratamat must wash! <laughs> Has it stopped, B2? I think it has, B1. Ratamat is going back where he came from. But, Rat, that means you'll have to do the work now. I know! It makes me tired just thinking about it. So what will you do? I'll do what I always do, of course. Nothing! Precisely. <laughs> <laughs> What a beautiful day for a walk by the lake. So peaceful. So quiet. Bananas! Did you hear that, B2? I did, B1. There! You're going the wrong way! You don't want to be late, do you? Late for what, Morgan? For Topsy's Shake and Bake Party. Topsy's Shake and Bake Party? You haven't forgotten, have you? Um, I don't think so. Just remind us, Teddies. What is it again? It's a party where everyone shakes and does their favourite dance. And bakes. And makes their favourite pies. My dance is called the Teddy Bear Bounce. See? Bouncing, bouncing, bouncing. <laughs> Morgan! Are you all right, Morgan? Fine, thanks. Here, Morgan. We can help you out. Look out for the slippery mud, B1. What's slippery? <laughs> Sorry, bananas. Now I've made you even later. Not to worry, Morgan. Shake and bake time. Here we come. The first thing we need is something to bake. Something very, very tasty. Something from our very own garden. Hmm. Can you see anything, B2? Nothing, B1. None of our vegetables have grown yet. Oh, dear. What are we going to do? Let's think about it while we eat our apples. Apples? Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B2? I think I am, B1. It's apple pie time! That should do it, B2. Right, B1. Here's the last one. You know, there's only one thing I like more than baking apples, B2. What's that, B1? Eating them, of course. Mmm, what's that delicious smell? It's coming from the banana's house. I'd better go and see. There, B2. Our apple pie is ready. 
It looks good, B1. And smells good, B2. Mm. But it's too hot to eat right now. So we'll leave it here to cool on the windowsill. Morning, bananas. Morning, Pedro. Mmm, <laughs> what a delicious looking pie. It's just baked. Apple pie, fresh from the oven. I love apple pie. It's my favourite. Can I please have a piece? Just a little one. Sorry, Pedro. You'll have to wait for Topsy's shake and bake party. Shake and bake party? You shake and do your favourite dance. And bake something tasty to share. And that's why we baked our apple pie. To share with our friends at the party. And you can have some there. Now we better go and practice our dance, B1. The banana split, B2. I think we need more practice, B1. Ooh, a lot more practice, B2. Then let's do it. Bye, Pedro. Oh, lovely, lovely pie. I'm sure it wouldn't hurt to take just one teensy, weensy, tiny piece. <laughs> Oh, 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 delicious. The best apple pie ever. Just maybe a teensy weensy bit more. <gasps> oh, there's no more. I, I've eaten it all. Great dancing, B1. Great dancing, B2. Oh no, the bananas. Shall we see if our pie is cool now, B1? Please don't look. No, let's check it later. Phew. We still need some homemade lemonade for the party. That's right, B1. Let's pick some lemons. What have I done? What will my friends the bananas say? Oh, dear. Oh, my. I know. I'll make them another pie. Oh. But I'm too short. I'll never reach those apples high up in the tree. Oh, so I can never make an apple pie. Maybe I'll make another pie. A special Pedro pig pie. Lemons look so juicy, B1. Just right for lemonade, B2. We'll soon be off to Topsy's shake and bake party. Here come the bananas. Oh, we can't wait to see the lovely pie you baked. It's an apple pie. Yum! <coughs> no time for pie just yet. First, we need to do some exercise. Shaking! That's right, it's dance time. Hooray! Over to you, Charlie. Let the dancing begin. Look, everyone, it's the teddy bear triangle. It's going to fall. And watch how a real dancer does it. <laughs> Look out, rat! Watch the pies! <laughs> our pie, B2! Catch it, B1! <laughs> oh, good catch, B2! You too, B1! Not all of them, Lulu. Uh, good work, Bananas. Thanks to you, we have one pie left. And I think it's time we all had a little taste. Mmm, it looks delicious. I bet it tastes delicious too. Oh, 
Yeah. Oh, bananas! What did you put in this? Apples. Can't you taste them? <laughs> we can only taste mud. Mud? It's not an apple pie, it's a mud pie. What sort of a trick is this, bananas? It's no trick. There's been a pie mix-up, B2. A bad pie mix-up, B1. Don't worry, everybody. We'll run home and get the real pie. We won't be long. <laughs> no sign of our apple pie over here, B1. And no sign of our apple pie here, B2. Hmm, where did it go? Look. What is it, B1? A trail of apple pie crumbs. And it's leading away from our house. You mean our apple pie ran away? Either that or it's been pineapped. Pineapped? Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B2? I think I am, B1. It's Detective Bananas time. I've still got this trail in my sights, B2. Me too, B1. <laughs> Detective Banana 2? What is it, Detective Banana 1? I think I found something. What? The trail of crumbs ends here. At Pedro's pen. Hello, Bananas. <laughs> Pedro? Why aren't you at Topsy's Shake and Bake party? I was, uh, too shy to go. Shy? Why? Because I'm the one who ate your pie. You? I'm sorry, but it smelled so delicious. I just couldn't stop. And so you swapped it for a mud pie? Yes. Now I've spoiled the shake and bake party. All because I ate your apple pie. Couldn't you have just made another one? My legs are too short to reach the apples up in the tree. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B2? I think I am, B1. It's apple picking time! Thanks, Bananas. Oh, you've made it so easy to pick these apples. Always happy to help. Right, B1? Right, B2. Bananas, you're back! Did you find the apple pie? We did better than that, Lulu. We found Pedro. Wow! Pedro! That's the biggest pie I've ever seen. The bananas helped me make it. It's for everyone to share. How simply scrumptious. Oh, let me go and get the plates. I'll put it on the table. Pedro! Look out! Oh, 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 oh. Good catch, B2. Sorry, Bananas. No problem, Pedro. Now, who's for a slice of apple pie? Hooray! Hooray! <laughs>